Hey everyone, it's Dr. Dawn. Welcome to my video. So on this channel we talk about all things feminine beauty and power. Say hi Boba. And we're going to talk about my favorite hobby which is working out. And I got some Calvin Klein workout gear to try on. I was looking for some new workout, I mean again, working out three, four times a week. I feel like that's where I want to prioritize a lot of my clothes. I kind of have my work outfit set, but I get bored with workout gear. But I'm not feeling the prices. I was looking on a lot of the more trendy, popular brands, and we all know I love Bombshell. Here's my Bombshell. Very simple set. Gotta love it. I need to find some new black leggings. I think these are a little bit see-through. There's some deodorant there. So I'm gonna keep these just to wear as black leggings and I wanna find some new black pants. So I was looking, anyway, side point. I was looking at all the trendy brands that you see on YouTube, that you see on Instagram, and their prices are bananas to me. Even some of the Amazon, I was looking there. I don't want cheap workout clothes, but it seems like the norm is like $80 minimum for leggings, which I think is crazy. So I remember going into a Calvin Klein outlet and really liking these leggings here. So these are super thick. I mean, super thick. Some of the reviews, they complained about how thick they are. I love how thick these are. So I'll try these on over there. This is a, it's called Moon Rock. It's kind of like a gray taupe color, which I really like as a neutral. It goes with gray. It goes with taupe. Love these. I'll try these on. $20. $20. So I'm loving these prices. I'm going to go back and get some more. I also got this. Sports bra for $20, which is like really fun and sexy. I'll try this one on, but I don't like it. This one was a fail. And then lastly, this sports bra here with this crisscross logo. So I'll try that on with the leggings too. Really quick try on. Just wanted to go through this brand that I think is actually underrated for workout clothes. I think the quality is fantastic. We'll talk about sizing and the prices. This one was 38, so this was the most expensive. But I cannot get over how inexpensive some of the leggings are. So I'll be right back. Okay, so first outlet outfit here. <clears throat> This is from the Calvin Klein outlet website for Calvin Klein performance. So a couple key things. These leggings are a medium. They fit <laughs> true to size. High waistband, logo on the back, and this really thick rib material. So what I will say about the leggings is they're a great pair of simple, comfortable, functional leggings. I will put these in the functional category. You can do anything in these. You can lift weights. You can do anything else that you do. Cardio, whatever. They're really supportive. I think that if you're concerned with things like cellulite, these are going to be great because the thick rib really smooths everything out. I think these are great quality. So I will say some of the cons are there are no, you know, accentuating. They're not super accentuating. But you know what? To be honest, I kind of like that more. I'm kind of over. Sorry, I'm trying to fix the back. Is that better? No. Okay, we'll fix it in a minute. I am kind of over the booty accent legging trend. I think that it's overdone. Of course, I'm gonna still wear it. I'm gonna still wear my bombshell. I'm still gonna wear it. But I like that these are just 
simple and functional. And you have the front seam here. And on me, they hit just above the ankle. So nice, you know, supportive band right there. Not see through at all. Really great. Other cons, you're not gonna get a lot of compression here. So again, this is on me and where the band hits. It's a very high band. My belly button's right here. My belly button's right here, okay. So I think that might be an issue on some people. It's great to have this waistband here because it accentuates the hips, but you're not really getting any compression here. So if that's a concern, you might not like the way that these fit. Um, there is actually some kind of loose. It's not as tight as I would want it here. I noticed that too. Like when I sit down, you see that? So I don't know if I could have gone down a size. I'm happy with just how comfortable these are. I'm not really concerned. But I would say maybe if you are between sizes, maybe go down a size or order your true, true size. Okay. Sports bra. Love this. This is a small and if you're in between sizes, size up. Okay, this barely fits me as a small, which is my normal size, and there's no adjustable straps. So love this, love the little branding, love the open back. I love that this is just a band. I love that. It did have removable padding, took that out. Love the lift, it's supportive. This is a medium impact is how they're advertising it. I'm gonna pick this up in a different color too. So let me know what you think. Do you think this is cute? Do you think the branding is too much? I love it, I'm super happy. Again, for this to be $60, instead of one sports bra being $60, I'm gonna go back and order some more. And again, you can see how this is gray writing, but it matches the gray taupey color of these leggings. I will say with the sports bra, a couple things. I love how thick this is here. Super supportive. Um, it, Like I said, size up in this one. It's a little bit tight. Like I can feel it digging into my skin a little bit. The other thing too, so okay, if you are concerned with extra body fat here, right there, I would not get the sports bra. Just because of the design where this fits, all of that skin is just going to poke through. Um, maybe sizing up will help that. I mean, this band fits me perfectly it's these straps that are a little tight so I would say if you I think Calvin Klein gears them so what I learned is that Calvin Klein I think is going to flatter people with a lower body fat percentage so you're going more for the very lean honestly they're gonna look better in my opinion from my experience just because some of the design Okay, I can see this really not being flattering on people with a higher body fat. And I can see this looking really good on women who are even lower, more lean than me. So I think it's a good way to accentuate curves. And I would say if you are more on the lean body type, check out Calvin Klein. If you are more of a higher body fat percentage and you love this, let me know. I would love to see it. I would love to be completely wrong in my opinion. I love being wrong. It's one of my favorite things. So let me show you the one sports bra I don't like and I'll be right back. Okay. So this is the other 
sports bra that I got and I hate it. So let's talk about all the reasons why I hate it. First, let's talk about why I got it because I thought it was cute. I thought it was different. I like in bar class to wear different styles that are a little bit not traditional more dance, more performance, whatever you want to call it, just because it's fun, and why not? And I wear workout clothes, and I wear work clothes. So I want to express myself. But anyway, what do I hate about this? This is a medium, and it is too small. They were sold out of the smalls, which is mind-blowing to me. So I ordered a medium, and when I got it, I was like, oh, it's going to be too big. This thing is so small. The band is small, this is small, it, these straps. So let's start there. Okay, it looks better on camera. I will give you that. This is not flattering. I think the design is cute, but there's just too many things wrong with it. Let's start here. This is too long. So this comes to too far to my waist I mean this would be cute maybe as a top but for working out I can't really see it you're gonna get this pinched skin I go and sit down okay there's not enough space between the waistband and the bottom of the sports bra so that's not cute if anything you're just gonna get it doesn't matter you're just gonna get the skin poking through here. These, I like the little branded meshy part with that. I mean, again, cute design. This is, it's itchy, it's tight, it's hard to put on. This is uncomfortable. I mean, this is a deal breaker right here. These straps are too thin and just cheap. I think that if these were like in a thicker maybe velvet, it would be so much better. And then what going up to a large? No. No, it's too small. Hate the back. I hate it. It's square. It's boxy. So anyway, this is a no, but just wanted to show you in real life what this looks like what i will say too is the clothes look very much how they do on the models online very realistic advertising overall i am happy that i tried this brand and i'm definitely going to pick up some more pieces this one's going back the other two are going to stay so hope you like this let me know if you have any questions let me know if you're interested in calvin klein performance just what you think about the brand anything that I should know. Take care. Bye.